I'm thrilled to announce Bird for Joy, a new podcast about discovering the different ways bird watching can bring joy into our lives. Bird for Joy is not just another bird themed show, it is a passion project, one I can't wait to share with the world. I'm Candy Lynn Fight, your host and fledgling birder who has developed an insatiable curiosity for avian marvels. I invite you to join me in learning the method of slow birding and what our feathered friends can teach us about nature, life, joy, and ourselves. I envision this podcast helping build a community of like-minded birders where the extraordinary lives of these winged wonders can be celebrated and appreciated. The episode topics will be a symphony of engaging content, combining insights of personal experiences from the field, lessons I learn as a newbie birder, heartwarming stories, the benefits that birdwatching has on our lives, and how we can discover pure joy just by being around birds. Dear listeners, I aim to inspire you to develop a deeper connection with nature and help ignite your own passion for these remarkable, fascinating creatures. The official launch for Bird for Joy is June 30th, and new episodes will release weekly. But for the next three weeks, I'll release four pre-launch minisodes to give the listeners some insight into me as the host and the show itself. The minisodes will go out June 2nd, the 9th, 16th, and the 23rd. A gracious shout out to composer Jonathan Boyle for his cheerful jazzy tune called Plucking Happy. This musical piece, coupled with my own birding experiences, inspired me to write lyrics for the musical piece. And now, please enjoy the full version of Plucking Happy with the spoken lyrics of my poem, Bird for Joy's Sake. Bird, for joy's sake, when you're needing more, a new beginning, feeling lost, alone or blue, go into nature, stroll to the melodious tunes of birdsong, let it refresh your soul, fill your heart, lift your spirits, yes bird, for joy's sake, witness the winged wonders flitting, fluttering, playing hide and tweet, is there anything else so sweet, I think not. Well, save for the chitter-chatter of my own nestlings as they filled my early days. But sigh, no more, for they have long left the nest, and I now strive to find myself once again, discovering new things that I do best. Bird, for joy's sake, for our feathered friends have much joy to share, and it doesn't cost a dime. Only time. And I don't know about you, but I am willing to give, to have a chance to live out my days, filled with curiosity, hope, and wonder, learning patience, the art of slowing down and being fully present, living in the moment, something I have long strived to achieve. Bird, for joy's sake, and keep looking up. Let their constant cheer infect you, their tenacity provides you with lessons of never giving up and looking on the brighter side of life. Prepare for entertainment with their quirky, chirpy silliness. Oh my, so much cuteness, happiness, and whimsy. You can't help but smile. And suddenly, you'll discover worries cease, frustrations fade, chaos calms, and troubles melt away like snow in the spring. You will find yourself looking up and forward into the horizon, Surrounded by song, hope and happiness perched in your heart, feeling renewed and fulfilled. Go out into nature, take a stroll, let the avifauna rejuvenate your soul, and bird for joy's sake. <laughs> <laughs> 